everybody, this is Moshe, the electric Israeli. Um, 1991, leading to the election of 1992 between George H. Bush and Bill Clinton. Bill Clinton put a sign, there was a sign in Little Rock, Arkansas, a big sign. It says, it's the economy, stupid. And on, it's the economy, stupid, he won. What is the connection? Today I want to talk about the uh, amazing surge of, of, uh, of uh, selling and buying cars, electric and plug-in cars in America. For 17 straight months, there is a continuous climb in sale of electric and hybrid, I mean electric and plug-in uh, hybrid cars. Last month, for example, there was a, an increase of 50% in sales. Now, if you take all the sales in America and you put them in 1 to 100%, the uh, sales of uh, electric or uh, plug-in hybrids is, I don't think it's near the decimal point, it's point something. So, um, but, what you want to see is steady growth and then hopefully going to be a spike. And why is the economy stupid? Because when you drive and own an electric car, you see the benefits uh, that you get. First of all, performance, comfort, and, and uh, later on the, uh, the economic numbers, obviously, uh, the, uh, if it's a pure electric car, the very, very tiny, uh, expense of uh, energy especially if you have a setup like I do uh, with solar panels and all that and uh, the long-term benefits of owning and maintaining let's not forget owning and maintaining a, an electric car or pr a plug-in hybrid car how much easier that is uh, to uh, own and maintain an electric car and the long-term um, the long-term uh, benefits, not only personally, but also uh, to the environment. Now, most people, I mean, I believe that many of you are watching me now or watching my channel or similar channels like this, uh, I would say diehards or interested or inspired or whatever. So if you are interested, inspired, or if this is your mission, I am basically talking to the uh, preaching to the choir, preaching to the converter. What we need to do is take videos like this, like this one I'm doing and many others and share them all around like I do. I always share and I always like and I always, uh, uh, you know, find inspirations with others. I can name you many, many channels of many individuals who do what I do and inspire other people and that's so important. But for the person who has no knowledge of what electric car is or what or what uh, the effect and the benefits of electric car, the, I think the best argument for, for, for people like that or, 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 for people, or for people like us trying to, to inspire others, it's talk about the economics. Let's talk about the economics because the economics, once you, I talk to so many people who, tell, who still ask me, what's the MPG for uh, my Nissan Leaf? <laughs> I said, there's an MPG E. Okay, so what's an MPG? I don't think I know it myself, but that's okay. I, I, my answer is it's good. You save a lot of money. When, when people hear money, they like their ears come up. And you have to explain people how beneficial this is. So I talk to people about the tax incentives, about the lease, uh, the lease uh, 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 prices that you can get, or buying a used electric car. I did a whole video about the, buying a used electric car and how credible, credible deals you can get. And people say, oh, okay. Uh, I ha and and uh, and what's the uh, uh, benefits for them personally? Then they're going to be inspired. It's like, uh, you know, I'm, I'm in education and I believe in giving kids candies, bribery. Give them a candy and then he, do some, he does something for the candy and then they kind of understand it and like it and then the candy is just a whatever, they don't even care about it. In, in other words, the, 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 the hook, the, the, the leverage should be um, 
should be the economic benefits. And then later on say, oh, it's good for the environment. Oh, it's this, oh, it's that. Oh, oh okay. You know what? I, I inspired so many people to go into uh, electric cars and plug-in cars and, and solar panels just by the economic. And later on, it came the other benefits. People say, oh, okay, so I'm doing something good for myself, for the environment and, and all that. And, and especially now when there is an absolute assault on what is it that we do uh, in terms of policies and changing of policies. I know that the auto industries are lobbying to uh, postpone or cancel the 54 miles per gallon mandate that's supposed to come up. I don't know if it's 2020 or 2025, I don't remember. But anyway, so it's the people, it's the people, it's the people who are going to make this happen or are making this happen. Look at Norway. I know the government give you a lot of incentives and, and, and all that. And, and Norway, they're going to go to maybe 90%, maybe 100% of electric or plug-in hybrid cars in the near future. So look at the numbers, look at the, the statistics are on Inside EV website. I'm going to put the link down below. And you look at the, the month by month, go for last year, month by month, and see how it increased, it increased. It's because people, once you put them in an electric car, once, once they drive it, and once they understand the economics of it, then they're like, oh, oh my God, this is amazing. This is great. I'm, I'm in it. I had convinced people uh, doing what I do, just putting them behind the wheel. I said, go ahead, take a, take a drive. Here's the key, take a drive, come whenever. In, in, it's like, it's like a, an epiphany. Uh, that's what happened to me. I remember I drove the first Chevy Volt in 2010, a test drive, and I was like, holy crap, this was a rocket. And then I was hesitant, I didn't know the economics and blah, 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 but eventually, you know, you plant the seed, in somebody's mind and then and then it becomes a reality so please right now if you're not subscribed to this channel please subscribe please share it put it on your Facebook put it on whatever whatever social media you use and spread the word because we from from the uh, 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 lobbying point of view and from the, all the detractor and the distractors and the destroyers who's trying to uh, all this progress that we've made and the numbers show the numbers are are Speak for themselves. So please continue inspiring continue um, uh, 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 Spreading the news and put you know, I like always say put Fannies on, on seats if you have an electric car have your friend drive it and Inspire other people to do the same thing and so with that I want to thank you for being a part of my channel subscribe and like it and share it and like my Facebook page and, and all that and help me change the world one electric car at a time great weekend